Hello, everyone. I am Joy Fan, and I am the Kentucky Dolly Mom. If you are one of my amazing subscribers, welcome back. And if you're new, welcome. And if you would like to become one of my amazing subscribers, please click on the subscribe button and a notification bell so you can be notified when I upload a new video. I want to welcome, welcome everyone. And I am so, so glad, happy, and appreciate you all so very much. Um, I am so happy that you stopped by to visit my and my little corner of the world. And right now, of course, I have old Smiley here, my Braxton Nicole. Um, and I'm playing catch up as always, guys. Um, but today I'm doing on Wednesdays, We Wear Pink. And I know my little Braxton just came out and I believe she was here for the young, um, So Blue Dolly Sunday, but, um, I'm doing the, on Wednesdays we wear pink and that is hosted by the lovely Shara at Living Reborn Dolls. If you haven't discovered, uh, Shara yet, please check out her, uh, channel. I will have her linked in the title. Uh, and I had to bring my little Braxton back out to help with today's tag because right this moment, she's only the only little girl I've got um, finished. I'll put it that way. Um, and yeah, I've said that I don't really do uh, gender colors, um, but when it comes to pink, I do. I see guys wearing pink shirts, and I think they look nice, but I really don't have anything pink that a little boy can wear, so my little Braxton's going to help me today. She's still in her beautiful little dress. Here's her little Mabel. She's still in her beautiful blue dress with the white lace, and she has on little tights and her little white walking shoes and blue headband but we as i said are going to go into pink today so we are going to put this adorable little um it is a let's see it is a well i must first one first one you it's a carter's and it's a newborn size sorry guys still haven't got my glasses um it's a newborn size in a hot pink a bright pink and it has two blue birds on them kind of an aqua blue i believe they are love birds with a little white heart over top and it snaps between the legs and my husband brought me these adorable little pink pants. They are, uh, it, they, I can see the size uh, is zero to three months, but I don't see a uh, brand. But they're a very light pink with Minnie Mouse with her bright little smile and big pink bow. Isn't that adorable? My husband just brought me those home the other day. So it'll be the first time anyone's wore them. And then I'm going to top her off with this little gray uh, hoodie. Got the cutest little ears. And I'm not real, real sure what that's supposed to be, but I think it's kitty cat. I'm going to call it a kitty cat. Looks like a kitty cat. Or a puppy dog or a bunny rabbit <laughs> but they've got little pink ears gray hood and it's light gray trimmed in pink with pink buttons and because she wants to have a snack after the video and get her some cookies and milk I thought we would go ahead and get her ready for her snack by putting on this cute little 
um, onesie that are in Tory's center. It's a white background, light pink stripes, and it has pink and yellow flowers with green leaves. And it's kind of like the, um, uh, I guess you'd call it like a bandana type um, with the Velcro in the back. And I'm also going to put these cute, cute, there. you guys have followed me for a while. You know you've seen these because they're the cutest ones I have. Um, these little white lacy socks with a little pink bow, pink ribbon trim, and it looks like a little uh, pink, uh, little pink set in the center with little tiny uh, white like diamonds. <laughs> we're going to call them diamonds, huh? Socks. And then we're going to put these cute little uh, white shoes. My mom always called them crib shoes um, because they were soft. They're a material type shoe. Little pink uh, shoelaces. They have a pink and purple trim around them with little flowers that are pink and green going across the front. So we're going to get her all changed up here today. And I do, like I said, appreciate you guys stopping by so very much. And I hope everyone is doing well. Um, I am, as I said, not been feeling really well, so I'm having to play uh, a little catch up to try to, because I do enjoy the videos. I enjoy making them so very much, but I, I enjoy visiting with you guys, and I enjoy being able to support my Dolly friends that have the hashtags. Um, and I just feel lousy when I don't get to see you guys. I really, it, it just, it brings me down emotionally. Physically right now, I'm not feeling very well. But if I didn't have you guys, I'd be emotional wreck right now. I really, really would. With other things going on, I would definitely be an emotional wreck if I didn't have you guys to lean on. And I do really appreciate you all so much and I really appreciate everyone that takes the time and has the imagination to come up with the tags uh, so again this is Shara's tag from Reborn Living Dolls and uh uh, you don't know Shara, please go over and check her out and give her some love. Because I think everybody right now, we're feeling something. And it's not always good. <laughs> it's not always good. So, uh, we're going to start out with this onesie. And I never, I've got to be honest with you guys. I've never watched the movie Mean Girls. <laughs> when I first started doing Shara's video, or her hashtag, I thought maybe I should go watch the movie and I'd kind of understand this a little bit better. But I got common sense, so I'm going to guess that in the movie, the girls wear pink <laughs> on Wednesday. Um, but it's not a movie that I've watched. And it, it, I seem to remember hearing it or seeing bits and pieces of it in the background um, because I'm pretty sure my granddaughter and my daughter watched it. But I haven't seen the movie. But we look pretty in pink and we want to support our sweet dear Miss Shara, so we are absolutely, even though I'm a purple person, <laughs> I am still very much 
enjoying uh, the tag and her wearing pink because I like pink too. It's not my favorite color, of course, purple is, but I do like pink. And I like to add, uh, kind of add pink and, and purple together. And I love the uh, color uh, like teal with pink and purple. So I like all colors. I love every color, pretty much, pretty much. But my all-time favorite color is purple, and I love the color purple and black together. But uh, we have had absolutely nothing, nothing but rain here. So when it gets dark early, uh, and then you've had no sun and real gloomy and rainy all day. Uh, it kind of, uh, you know, makes it a little darker in here. But I do try to have the light, as many lights on as I can. So I am hoping that it's not too dark. And these little pants are actually a little snug. They're a little bit snug on the girl. But they're not really tight, so she can still wear them. But I do hope everyone is. I, she, I put her a little brace back here to help her because sometimes she gets so giggly that she just uh, topples right over. You know, this little girl loves to smile and giggle. She is a little laugh machine here. But I tell you, she, she definitely puts a smile on my face just looking at her. Uh, I do hate this rain. I'm just, I mean, I don't mind rain, but come on. It has been raining and raining and raining. And it just makes everything so dark and gloomy. Uh, but even as dark and gloomy as it is outside, my sweet little Braxton's got her big old smile on. And she just can't help it. Oh, come on, girly. Get on, on girly. I thought we had you fixed here. To where you wouldn't topple over so easily. But she just gets to giggling. She can't help it. Still don't have my Christmas tree up. I've got the tree sitting on the table where it goes. It's just a little four foot tree. But no, my daughter hasn't came over to help yet. And my son said he would help me, and to be honest, guys, I'm really having a hard, hard time getting in the Christmas spirit this year. It seems like the whole year has just really been lousy. I mean, my daughter moved out. I found out I've got a heart condition. Uh, it's not been a good year for me, but this to shall pass. You know, I've been through worse. Not worse than my daughter moving out. No, well, I, I, no, I'm I, not going to even say that. Uh, I have definitely been through worse, and I have survived. Uh, tell my friends all the time, you know, things happen, and things happen sometimes that we can't control. And you can either decide to be a victim or you can decide to be a survivor. I'm a survivor. I refuse to be a victim. Uh, I'm a survivor of two strokes. <laughs> uh, I'm a survivor of losing my precious great grandbaby at only three months old. I'm a survivor. Uh, 
instead of putting this little hat on because it is way too big. <laughs> she does look awful cute in it, though. So we'll keep it there for a minute. We'll keep it there for a minute. But I do have a headband here. And I think I will put on her instead of that hat because I don't know about you guys, but even if the outfit, the, the jacket, or whatever it is, fits to a T, the hats, the attached hats always seem to be huge, not even a little bit big, huge. <laughs> And she is adorable with the, aren't you sweet cheeks? Yes, she's my sweet cheeks. But we'll just pull it down for now and put this headband on. It's way too big for her too, but it's pink and she looks cute in it. So she's gonna, she's gonna wear that. There she is. Look how sweet she looks. Oh my goodness. She absolutely looks adorable in her little Minnie Mouse pants that her daddy brought home to her. And I'm not, I'm just going to rake it up, guys, so y'all can see her, but. Well, that's not too bad. It's as high as up as I can go with the stain, uh, tripod, so hopefully I didn't blur that out or make that a mess because I did want to show her little legs. Show them cute little legs, them little Mickey Mouse, Minnie Mouse, their adorable little shoes, and that sweet, scrumptious smile. We're going to give her back her Mabel because she absolutely loves Mabel. Oops, I know she's ready for a snack. She's wanting to get her cookies and her milk, aren't you, sweetheart? So Mama said I, if she wanted to do the video, I'd go ahead and put the little bib on. So she can be all ready for her snack after we get finished. Sit in her little high chair and have her some cookies and milk. Isn't she sweet? My little Braxton Nicole is the Cairo Sculpt by Ping Lao. And I absolutely love this little girl. That smile just really warms my heart. She can take a pacifier. But she told me she was getting too big for it. So, she doesn't like it very often. And she said she's going to borrow this little pink bear just because it's pink. And we've always got the big old pink pig in the background. Big old pig. He, little pig, big pig, kind of guards everybody. Make sure everybody's okay. But guys, it's it for me today. I do absolutely, as I said, appreciate you all so much when you come by and visit me in my little corner of the world. I do pray for each and every one of you. If you can hear my voice, please know that I sincerely, sincerely have you in my thoughts and prayers because God doesn't need a specific name. To, for me to have a specific name for him to know who I'm talking about. And please, please, please give God thanks. Because if it wasn't for him, we wouldn't be here in the first place. Be kind, be nice, and be supportive to one another. Because you never know what someone's going through. And as I said, I am trying to play catch up, get my videos up and going. Uh, but I am as weak as a two-day-old kitten. But I do enjoy these very much. 
do enjoy these videos so much. I enjoy visiting with you all so much. So, thank you guys for coming by. And I do, with all my heart, love and appreciate every one of you. And I do hope that you're having a blessed, blessed day. Thanks, guys. Bye-bye.